Would you like to win a 5.2 billion pound man? Billion? Whoa. Whoa. Would you like to win a 5.2 billion pound mansion this Christmas? Of course you would. Who wouldn't? Even a billionaire would be happy with that. Stay tuned, and I'll tell you how to enter. So this is my first video within the Martini Universe channel. I wanted to keep James Martini films slightly separate for my pro work, stuff I film and edit for clients. The behind the scenes and things like that is still gonna be put there. And uh, also the art and science of filmmaking, the tutorials about, you know, how, what is aperture? What is shutter speed? What is the focal perspective? And how does it change and manipulate the image? How do you get good sound? With which mics do I use? Camera gear tests, things like that. So it's all filmmaking related. This, however, no restraints. No restraints at all, you see. Martini Universe. I actually called it Martini Universe because I did Martini with two eyes taken. And I thought, out of curiosity, I don't want Martini with three eyes, but also taken four eyes taken. Who's having martini with five eyes? It's martini universe, not world, not earth, not uh, life, not anything like that, because they're all taken. This is going to be about me and my life. It'll be a bit more for everybody. So it's going to be about me as an impersonator, how I go about, and all the fun things that I get up to. Uh, um, Impersonation-wise, I do Colin Farrell. I'm a genuine Hollywood star. Give a big, warm, Dublin welcome to Colin Farrell. I do um, Sean Connery when he's a young man, yes. <laughs> Put myself on the spot here. I do Jack Sparrow. I do Rambo. Yeah, yeah. King Leonidas. I do Drogo, I do Jon Snow as well, which is also from Game of Thrones. Uh, when I'm looking particularly rough and old, I do Michael Caine. Not often, but I do. Sometimes, um, I forgot his name. God, what is his name? Anyway, I do many characters. So, you know, I'm booked by different companies and whatnot. Also, DIY. I love it, you know, I don't like the idea of sending my stuff off back to a company and who's charging an extortionate amount of money uh, for something that I could fix myself quite easily. So I love knowledge and uh, I like and enjoy to fix things like how to fix an iPad, a MacBook or an iPhone screen if you smashed it like an idiot. Well, I've done it and I will show you things like that. Uh, how to replace your brakes on your car, how to make music, I like to sing. Oh. Um, also, I'm filming a film called The Iconics, which I've been filming for like six years. And you'll see behind the scenes of that, ventures in my life, and just maybe some live chilled footage of just my life in every day. Oh yes, maybe some life advice, if it takes my mood. Do what you love, because if you don't do what you love, you won't love life. Stuff like that, but probably longer and more probably think about before I speak. Anyway, what else? Yeah, so a lot to subscribe for. How to edit like a pro, so how to mask out things and little, little tricks, you know, things like a shortcut. Don't know where my voice has changed, but it has. Oh yes, and the gym. I will show you good techniques to build muscle fast.
this traffic, I might as well talk about what I'm going to be filming today. And what I will be filming is what Mel was suggesting after this shoot with Boris Johnson. Um, Mel, this is the owner. Um, so that was essentially a promo video to uh, state that there's a competition on to win Dancers Hill House. Um, it was kind of like a it's clickbait essentially. Um, and then you see if there's a competition, then hopefully it gets people to enter. That's essentially what the idea behind it is. Um, but to, she, while, while, while I was there after filming, she suggested that we film something else as well. Um, she said she had another idea. Uh, Christmas Day, young girl wakes up, walks downstairs and goes to the Christmas tree. And under the Christmas tree is a present, a massive present. She opens it up and it's Dancers Hill House. And there's all like glitter coming off it and snow, it starts snowing and things like that. So um, that's kind of what she wants. Brought a big kit along with me today, or a motorized gimbal. I'm gonna use that for a long shot. You go walking down the stairs with it, following her throughout the house to the to under the tree. Um, we start with a drone shot of the actual house outside because it's a big four acre land. That mist is still there, it could look really, really like very Christmassy and nice. But it's getting warmer. It's Christmas! Jingle all the way. The traffic seems to have subsided. Still need to stop for petrol, but it seems quite strong still. A Christmas coffee from Custer. I was a bit bath by this. I pressed um, a white coffee and the majority of it obviously is water anyway but it was like just watery, just pure water. Still, Still this, this is, is not entertaining, not entertaining, entertaining enough. enough. Oh the weather outside is frightful though inside is quite delightful and since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Uh, wish the new the words. Doodle it do 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 do. Doodle it do do do. Bells ring. The love and understanding. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. But the very next day, you gave it away. Just like the ones I used to know Where the treetops is not repeat of the last verse Okay, I'm three minutes away now I'm on time Which is good I'm here oh, it's got... uh, I took that so slow and still Ooh, that was not good. Okay, there we go, let's go shoot. I always try to make my videos entertaining. Obviously that's the filmmaker and storyteller in me. Yes, but that entrance just did not cut it for such a beautiful driveway. The overexposed house and that 360 footage is just appalling. I can't just leave that in. So I need to spice it up a bit. A little bit of Hollywood. This is definitely more entertaining. Now I need something for the finale.
Yeah, that was slightly amusing. Slightly unfitting to the log, but, uh... Good. Good. Yeah, it was needed. You have a little problem. Oh no. no problem. Here. Right. Uh, the lady I'm sending it through to is my daughter in law, and she deals in marketing. And um, she said, We've got to change it. Because if everybody thinks it's the Prime Minister, really, mm -hmm. it could be in serious shock. Right. And she cited somewhere, someone used a model. A famous person, and they've taken him to court, and there's been a huge, huge harm that was only a few months ago. Right. So we've got to put at the bottom of the video, this is not the Prime Minister, it's got to run through the whole thing. So, <laughs> right? Yeah. Just in small print. Yeah? Okay. Okay, so the first shot of the day will be with the drone. I usually do the drone shots first because weather is so unpredictable, so when it's nice, take advantage of that. Also, it's quite good to have the bright light from the early in the day and the sunset later in the day or even night shots. So with the interior, you can obviously manipulate the lights. So yeah, before you fly, have a rough flight plan. That helps uh, prevent any kind of issues that you may incur. Also, don't forget, since December the 1st, it's UK law to have a flyer ID and an operator ID. You just do a little test and pay a little fee. Very simple. And you must put your ID on the drone itself as well. And obviously, obey all the laws in which now exist with drones in the UK. So there's an issue. I'm trying to take off, but it won't allow me to. This is flight is restricted in this zone, and specifically this zone, so I can't take off. And it says, warning sign, Nate Geo. So I've looked at Nate Geo, up, and uh, it's a summit of which is happening with Donald Trump locally. It's a temporary no-fly zone, so I may be able to fly later today. Fingers crossed, huh? Now, let's film some inside shots. So the first shot of the day will be in the bedroom where the girl is asleep and uh, wakes up and says, It's Christmas! Fantastico! And then she goes to the window. She sees, oh, lovely snow. So then she makes her way downstairs to the Christmas tree. Yeah, this. Yeah. So I used, I wanted to take this as one shot with uh, the gimbal. So I rose up and I said, action. It's Christmas. I've got a certain height so she can open up her eyes. Says, ah, oh, it's Christmas. Runs to there. Boom, opens up. So this shot was actually filmed downstairs because that's actually very, very, very high up. So we sprayed that with some fake snow. And uh, yeah, they, that works. Actually, rather than me getting on a um, 100 foot ladder. Yes, yeah, so the only break point there was the window shot. Here's another shot, which I had to track, which took quite a while with the snow, because it's obviously not snowing outside. It would just be inconsistent if I didn't have the snow there. Anyway, she's approached the presence, and that long walk actually gives a good time for titles to go above for this promo video, and obviously it shows the house itself. Yeah, see, as she opens that, it's, it's green, it's a little green box, so that allows me to chroma key it out in post. Um, so if her fingers or hair passes that point, I can key it out, you see, rather than have to mask individual hair fibres out, which... Um, wouldn't look so good that's what that's there for and I pop a light inside as well which kind of gives it 
um, a bit more mystique um, as it pops out of the box. Now the reason why I did the green screen only a certain height was um, so then I had some the real lighting from that situation of the box and makes it look a bit more real. Given the drone shot another go and it looks like the restriction has been removed. Fantastic. So now I'm going to get some lovely, lovely drone shots. So essentially for this competition, it's a raffle. So you buy a ticket at £13.50 and you're entered in for the draw. Now go on to windancershillhouse.com and all the information, terms and conditions will be on there. Good luck. Wow, this must be for everybody. This one must be for the family. So good luck on the competition if you enter. See you next time for another video within the Martini universe, my new channel, which is about vlogs. About vlogs? About, uh, psh, uh oh, fun stuff, entertaining stuff, my adventures uh, around the world, things like that. Someone's at the door, goodbye.